Now, I believe in strategy. I believe in giving you guys something that you can use day in, day out, every single month, every single year is when you are planning your goals. And I believe that when it comes to success, it's a six step success formula. And this applies to your fitness, this applies to success in your relationships, this applies to monetary wealth, this applies to any area in your life that you wanna be successful in. So I highly recommend you write this down. Only if you wanna find success in your life. <laughs> Other than that, don't write it down. The outcome of you being in this room is I want you to leave these five days feeling like you could work a shift immediately, start selling, making money for yourself and for your team. Even if you don't know the systems, that's our outcome. And what I want you to write down here with this more specifically is clarity is power. What is your red dot? What is the thing in your life that gets you out of bed every single morning, even if you don't want to get out of bed at 5 or 6 a.m., you get out of bed anyway, because if you don't, you think about the negative impact it will have in your life. You gotta have a good reason why. The person saying they want to make 50K, do they have a great reason why they want that number? No. no, their reason why is it's more than I've ever made before. And that was me when I first started, but I had the driving force of I want to be the best, and that caused me to be great. Not great in every area, but great in my own personal income. You gotta know what your outcome is. And you gotta know why it's important to you. If you say you wanna make 100 grand, you better have some strong reasons behind that. If your goal doesn't get you out of bed in the morning, you gotta set a new goal. You gotta have something that compels you. Know your reason why and be very, very clear and specific by writing down our goals. But we don't just write them down. We write down our goals and ask for things as if we cannot fail. Think in your mind right now, what would have to happen in the first 90 days for you to look back and be able to say, this was one of the most productive yet fulfilling quarters of my entire life. And I want you to put it in the chat. And it doesn't have to be a perfect plan. It's simply an outcome. What outcome do you want to look back on 90 days from now? Because 90 days, it's going to go by like a blink of an eye. We're already 12 days into the year. Now, the question I want you to ask yourself now is, what does an extraordinary life look like for you? An extraordinary, okay? Because we said here that we're here to make more money, to create our income. We said we're here for independence. We're here to control our destiny. We're here to control our cash flow. Okay, great, but if you ask yourself, okay, well, why is it important for us to earn more money? Why is it important for us to be able to create our schedule? Why is it important for us to really get what we put in and reap what we sell? Well, it's to live a better life, right? And my question is, what does that better life look like for you? Your thoughts determine how you feel, right? What you just thought about determine how you feel. The thing is, a lot of us are thinking about, oh, I gotta pay the bills. Oh, I gotta pay the rent. Oh, this person just blew me off. This person didn't answer my phone call while, while I was doing outreach. I dropped by the business today, they didn't answer. Oh, I wanted to do the AOD, but it just, they didn't wanna do it today. They want me to meet with the employees first. Things are going wrong, things are going wrong, things are going wrong. That creates momentum. And that momentum is what crushes us. This is why Jennifer gifted me one of those little trash recycling bin things. <laughs> And it's for your headspace. When you have a crappy thought, you just say, screw that thought. You pluck it out and you put it in the trash can, right? At the dollar store, you At can the get it. dollar store. Just a dollar. That's how much you're worth. <laughs> <laughs> how you take what you have inside of you, your gifts, your abilities, and how you use them to give back to other people. That's purpose.